of today, how to fix a broken latch on a dishwasher. Hey everybody, this is Still Do Tony. I'd like to welcome you to another episode of How to Fix Your Brain. On today's episode, we've got a dishwasher with a bad latch. I'm going to show you how to take it apart and install the latch. Now on a scale of 1 to 10, this is about a 1. This is very simple. Anybody can do it and you can restore a dishwasher without any problems at all. Now the repair we're doing today is pretty common. It's uh, the same for pretty much any dishwasher on the market these days, except for maybe those high-end jobs. The only tool we're going to need here today is a Torx bit screwdriver. You can get these pretty cheap just about any place, but that's that funny star-shaped bit on this thing. And you're going to need a new latch. I got this latch online at PartSelect.com. Okay, in order to get the right replacement switch, you need to find the model number. Normally the model number is on the inside of the dishwasher or on some sort of a plate or sticker like this. The model number on this one's right here. I'm going to go ahead and enter that number into the PartSelect.com website and get the right part. I ordered it on a Monday and it showed up on Tuesday. That's pretty amazing. So let's get going. Before you get started, I recommend that you turn off the power. Find a dishwasher's circuit breaker in your breaker box and turn it off. Okay, as you can see, the latch on this thing is non-functional. A lot of times when your latch is broke, you can't figure out how to get it open because it won't unlatch. When that happens, grab it firmly by both sides and try and pull it out. Now that actually came out pretty easy, but if it's stuck, just give it a bigger pull. Once you have it open, there are about 11 screws all the way around the inside of this door. You need to take all of those out. That's where we need that torque bit screwdriver. Just take them all out and save them. You're going to need them. Once you have all the screws out of there, the front and the back of this come apart. This is the bad latch right here. This comes out. Okay, looks like uh, whites, white wires are on the uh, my left this way. Just keep track of it. This has an L and an R on it. If yours doesn't have it marked, then go ahead and mark it. Basically hook it up the same way. Put your left and right. Set that right back in place. Put the back back in place. Put all the screws back in. Okay, now that we're done, we can turn the power back on and test it. Okay, that thing's locked. Push the button, it works. Close it, it works. Open it, close it. Open it, close it. Okay, let, let's test this. I'll hit start. It's on. Open it. It stops. Very cool. So this is Tool Dude Tony. I'd like to thank you for watching this episode of How to Fix Your 101. If you liked it, please press that like button and maybe subscribe to my YouTube channel and share it with all your friends. And uh, if, as I always say, if you're not fixing it yourself, you're paying somebody else to fix it. So get out there and fix something. Tool Dude, out of here.